Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Peachy and this channel is all about my Sylvanian Families collection. For today's video I'm going to be unboxing a new set into my collection. Um, I didn't have the box for this one so I've popped a picture of what the box would look like here. It is the Japanese exclusive interior shop set. I got this second hand on Kobe Japan and it was released in the early 2000s, I think around about 2002. So here it is, it's all in a bag at the moment. I've gone through this and popped it into one of my baggies but we'll take a look at everything the set comes with. Um, this looks like it was probably only displayed, none of the boxes and things have been put together yet and none of the stickers used. So considering I couldn't find one brand new, this is kind of as good as it gets. So if I open up the bag here, I've put all of the smaller accessories in the smaller bag and then we've got some larger kind of unit items that we'll take a look at first. So the set comes with these three display case units, so each one is kind of crafted for the different smaller accessories. You've got two in this lighter brown colour and one in the darker brown colour. I especially like this one because it says interior shop on the top here and also it's got this little glass case which you can open and close to put some items in. The detailing on these is really nice, I like the shapes. And on these ones they kind of look like wooden planks and then they've got this nice floral embossing on the top here. The wooden planks also are on the back. And this one is the same again, just a slightly different layout and it's got a little hook uh, piece here as well. So now if we take a look at the smaller accessories. So I've got them all in here. First up we have the paper pieces and some flatter pieces, so there's a kind of little rug in here, some slippers, and then for the paper pieces there's some stickers here, some double sided tape, and two boxes, so there's an afternoon like tea set and a stand light set. And these are boxes just to be folded um, up and it gives you instructions of how to do that there. So I'll go ahead and do that now. So these were quite fiddly to do but we got there in the end. They're a nice kind of thick card and they've got a kind of glossy finish so they look really nice. And then onto the other smaller accessories that come with the set. So you get a ton of stuff to put on these shelves and I think we'll set up the shelves as we go along. So I'm going to pop these two boxes onto this bottom shelf here as they look like they will fit really nicely in there. And then carrying on with this fixture first, so I'm going to set it up just like it is on the box for now and that will make sure I don't miss any of the accessories. So the first accessories you get are these beautiful ornate lamps, I absolutely love these. So they've kind of got this clear plastic shades in a Kind of turquoise and red coloration and then you can see the bulbs in there and gold detailing on the top they've got little scalloped edges and kind of a brown wood effect on the stands 
these are beautifully detailed and they're going to go on this shelf here and then also in lighting there's a little hanging lampshade here and this one is a lovely pink colour again scalloped around the edges and it's got the little bulb in there and this one just hangs from some string that is provided and this one is to go on this little hook here and then there's also I think these are called sconces is that the right word it's like a wall light and um, you attach it there and then it's got the kind of shade and you can see the little bulb in there as well again this is clear plastic to simulate glass and this one would stick like this on this display so I'm just going to do that with blue tack quickly today just so we can get the display set up but I don't want to put the double sided tape on just yet because these are going to end up getting put away again so and that one goes on like that and then this unit is kind of the lighting display then we're going to do this one so this has some more wall hanging items so there's this lovely wall clock adore this it's really pretty it's got this little strawberry on the, the pendulum and then the clock face is very not ornate that was a sticker that I've just stuck on it's got lovely wood effect and we'll pop some blue tack on the back of that and stick it onto the wall panels so the box shows it being here I'm sure these are going to fall off halfway through the video and knock everything over but we'll see how we go then there's a little door plate and shaped like a house you can see it's shaped like a little Sylvanian house with the traditional window so this one has a slot for a sticker and it, it can be bathroom living room or kitchen but I wasn't sure which one I wanted to put on yet so I've just left it blank for the time being while I decide which one I want to put on there and the box shows that one stuck here and then finally for wall hanging pieces there's this little multiple photo frame it's got these cute little flower details on it and three little photos and this one is shown as stuck down the bottom here like that and then also on this unit there's this little double wicker effect basket I love this it's super detailed even on the bottom really looks like uh, wicker it's got two compartments and the box shows that in here go the little slippers that and then also this kind of little rug or lap blanket and it's rolled up but this has been flat for a long long time so I don't know if it's going to stay so what I'm going to do is I'm going to wedge it under the bottom quickly before it all unrolls and that's how that unit looks then we also have some floor standing pieces so there's this absolutely adorable little freestanding post box or mailbox and it has this little welcome sign on it as well and the back is open so you could get letters in and out and the front has the little post slot then there's also this little yellow bucket and within that you can put a broom which is really nicely detailed I like the kind of thread or string here for the bristles and also a rake now this rake looks very similar to the one that comes with the vegetable patch it's got nice metallic silver plastic for the head and then the handle is kind of wood effect and these go in this little basket like so the box actually shows the broom that way up as I think it's a little bit top heavy 
There's also a little dustpan which has very ornate detailing on it. So it's got this cute little pink florally detailing on the top. It's also got kind of a scalloped back to it. I wish my dustpan was this cute. Mine's a very boring grey plastic, so this is much cuter. And finally, this little footstool or like tiny table, which has again really lovely green and pink floral detailing all around it, and then it's got like two legs. And then we move on to the final unit, and this is probably my favourite unit as it's got all the smallest accessories. So the top here is indented, and this is to hold the little plates that the set comes with. So there's this lovely kind of creamy one with floral detailing on and then there's two of this little light blue one with purple grape details and I like the kind of leafy um, florals around the edge as well and I thought this is really clever because I thought I was going to have to like balance them and prop them up but actually this is ridged at the top here and they just slot in really nicely and it holds them pretty securely so I think that's a really good kind of attention to detail to make this a bit more practical. Then I think I'm going to do the glass bit down the bottom. So in here, the box shows lots of the glassware pieces. So first of all, there's two of these kind of crystally glasses and they're a bit more detailed than the usual glasses. They're kind of pitted. I don't know whether that's showing up on ca camera. They kind of look a bit more like crystal, and you get two of those. Then you also get two lovely teacup and saucers, so I'll show you the green one first. So it's that clear plastic again, very similar or the same as what was on those lamps. And it's got this gold scalloping around the edge of the saucer. And then the teacup is the same plastic and then it's got these little kind of scallops in it and they're indented and you get a turquoise one and also a red one in the same design then you also get some bottles in the same kind of plastic again so the red and the green and these have lovely floors on it very pretty glassware well plastic but meant to be glassware and also a different shape of bottle a more rounded one Again with the floral details. And the box shows these all in that glass cabinet at the bottom. So I'm going to go ahead and try and pop those in. And I'm sure everything is going to fall over with my big fingers. That one's a bit uneven, so I think I'm just going to leave it propped like that. And then you can shut that section up. That red one doesn't want to stay, so it's just going to have to be fallen over for now. And then on the next shelf up, this one here, there's some more glassware items. So there's these again with the same glass and then also this detailing on them. I'm not sure, I know what these are but I cannot think of the word for it. So if anyone's got the name of these, if you pop it in the comments that would be really helpful because I cannot for the life of me remember what these are called. But you get two of those and also two little candlesticks with candles and again it's that same turquoise and red plastic to look like glass, little candles on the top and these ones are shown to go on this shelf just like that and then on the final shelf a few more small items so we have a photo frame I'm pretty sure this looks very similar to another photo frame from the Home Sweet Home living room set. Don't know if it's exactly the same, but very similar. 
silver, nice, nice metallic plastic with a cute little photo inside. Then this little carriage clock, white with some lovely floral detailing and again this clock face with a sticker that I've just popped on. I like the little legs on this one. A mirror, which is an interesting kind of, I'm not even sure what to call this green, it's like halfway between like turquoise and mint. Very pretty green colour with a mirror with a bow on it and also this little letters holder that you could slot letters in. It's got some nice blue detailing for the wording on the front. I'm going to pop these onto that final shelf. And there we have it, that's everything that comes with the interior shop. You just get so many accessories with this set, it's really really great. Um, I think I'm going to try and set mine up in my Tony Village store. I think this will kind of bulk it out nicely with lots of general store items. But yes, that's all for today's video. I hope you've enjoyed unboxing this set with me. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again next time. Bye bye for now.